uh, Camden County Cupcake Shop is closing down today, and it's not just any shop. This one gained national attention when it was first opened in 2019 by a 92-year-old man living out his dream. Marcus Espinoza has the story. I would say that just go for it. Follow your dreams no matter what. That's exactly what 93-year-old Ray Boutwell did back in 2019. We covered the story when Ray decided he wanted to open his very own boozy cupcake shop, and he did just that. Just go for it, work hard, and uh, continue to do what makes you happy. If you have a job that you love, you'll never work. Ray made that dream a reality. Unfortunately, some dreams we find ourselves waking up from just a bit sooner than we had hoped. On Sunday, Ray's Boozy Cupcakes opened its doors for the final time. He fractured his hip. Um, he had decided before then that it was time to sell because business came back a little bit, but then it wasn't quite coming back the way he wanted it to, and he decided it was time. Rosanna Mawson is Ray's daughter. Don't go telling her what her father accomplished was anything near a failure. And he really didn't fail because at 92, who opens a bakery, you know, it's and, uh, and, and a lot of work and he put a lot of his muscle into it. He built the ca some of the counters and refurbished them. He built the woodwork over the, the windowsill and all that kind of stuff. And in the back, he built some cabinets. So uh, a lot of labor of love went into this. Ray's Boozy Cupcakes may be history for now, but his next creations may prove to last a lifetime or two. He's forward looking. He wants to go back to his artwork and, uh, you know, do things like that or whatever else comes down the road. But I think he's uh, really going to focus on his artwork this time. In Voorhees, Marcus Espinoza, Fox 29 News.